Now, did we get tweezers from Ion? Yeah, you have tweezers and an audio device, don't you? Tweezers. Okay, we'll hand it over to uh, John Ion. As if tweezers weren't an audio device. Oh, he's got three things. Don't set well, that on my laptop. <laughs> well, okay. So, I was placing an order online. I saw that there was um, somebody was selling some bamboo tweezers. And they were out of stock, and I was like, darn, I want a bamboo tweezer. And I realized, wait a minute, I have all these bamboo chopsticks, and I made my own. And so I just took a Is chopstick, a cut it in half, in the house? and then you know, glued, you know, angled the ends, and then just made my own bamboo tweezers. Because they're ESD safe, they won't conduct any electricity, so I, I can like easily place you know, parts on a circuit when I'm trying to solder and hold them down with this. And you know, clip them into a little third hand to hold it down. I'm probably going to make more, so I can like have a little different things so that won't damage the little chips that I'll be working with on circuit boards. So, fun little hack. And I have some photos online on my uh, Flickr page. So if you go to Flickr slash Ion, I-O-N-N, you should see the bamboo tweezer photos there, me shaving away the bamboo there. Yep. And you'll link to it from the Fat Man and Circuit Girl forums, right? Yep. And, and, and uh, uh, someone wanted to know what MBM was. And the next one, how do we switch to camera one? Just hit one on live if you want to just... Hey, Ion? Okay, all right. And then this one... Oops, they were asking what... Uh... They were asking what? Yeah, yeah Ion, what, someone in the chat room wanted to know what MBM... Oh, that's nice. Yeah! Someone wanted to know what MBM was. MBM? That's a, or, one of the users on chat. Is that what you said? They're MBM approved or something like that? ESD maybe approved. Oh, ESD. Is yeah. it? Maybe that was the name of the person who. Oh, it was MBM. I got it backwards. That's the name of the person who asked. Yes. And then <laughs> this one is actually from Limor, who does Lady Ada stuff. This I just propped one together because I, I made a little. Uh, what it is is that you got a CDSL, and you're getting the value into a pin, and then based off of the light source. It's going to change the, uh, you know, how fast and how the tone of the peso. So, so the darker it is, the higher it is, and the lighter it is. So it's just a little fun little thing to play with. Is that a microcontroller? What is that? It's a my Arduino Demi Love, and I have the little, got just made this last week, the which we call a proto shield, and you just put it on, reset it, and just makes. And I have a, like a little tiny breadboard that I added to it to make it easier to just throw something together really fast. So, if you want, you can probably get two. You know, make the program so you can add like two different cells and two pesos, and maybe kind of like make a little theremin thing. pretty much it. Oh, the other thing is I was playing with the magnetic ma spheres that Jerry has and I found that if you connect them on both ends you know, got two little cylinders of magnets that kind of spiral upwards and then split it in half, bring it back and then mm -hmm. attach them again on where they you know, come together on the other end as well. And you just keep turning it and it just keeps feeding each other. So as it comes off the top, it goes on to the next uh, cylinder. And then the same thing happens on the other side. As you turn it, it's getting taken away from the one that's getting added to. So just fun little. Is there any gear reduction in that? Nope. No, it's one to one. It's one to one here. And I just tore it apart. Again. <laughs> so there has got to be. a little thing I did by accident last night. But do you think you could add gear reduction by making one of the loops smaller? Uh, I haven't tried that yet. Possibly, yeah. I, can I will try and do that later tonight and see what happens. And see if that there has work. got to be a unicycle transmission in there. <laughs> so, yeah, just have like linkages that will come over. Because I'm sure you could do it in other ways. And 